first of all, welcome to Sweden and the Swedish Rugby Union. Thank um, you. As we don't all know you, can you please give us some background on yourself and what you've done in English rugby? Yeah, super. Um, no, I'm delighted to be here. Uh, really excited um, with the challenge. Uh, so my background is um, I've been coaching for sort of 15, 15 years or so now. Uh, I started out at Loughborough University, um, coached the women's side there, and then I coached within the, the men's programme. I coached a lot of county rugby in Leicestershire, um, and then I moved on to take over running the uh, uh, rugby programme within a school, within a big independent school. Um, and at that point, I took over as director of rugby for the Lambs, which is an invitational uh, English under 18 side. Um, and then kind of progressed through there, and then I, I coached Scotland Women's under 20s for, for three years between 2013 2016. Um, and then, yeah, this exciting role came up and I, uh, I jumped at it. So mm -hmm. that's, uh, that's my background. Uh, in terms of coaching wise, I've uh, completed my RFU level three about 10 years ago um, and I've done a master's in, in coaching that was at Loughborough as well. Um, so uh, lots of practical side as well as the sort of theory side, which is, I find always useful. Okay. So where's your, what's your first impressions of Swedish rugby? Yeah, really good. Um, I, I, there's so much potential, um, some great athletes and really, really great people as well. And I, I just think that we can build something really special out here. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing the guys train and play uh, and then get a better impression in, in terms of where we, we build towards in the future. Have you met the players yet? Uh, no, not in person. So um, obviously with COVID, we haven't had the, the chance. We've had a Zoom uh, meeting where we've kind of uh, outlined the vision for what we want to achieve over the next sort of one, three and, and five years and then followed up with some one-to-one -one Zoom calls. Um, so I've spoken to the majority of the, the players where it's been possible. Uh, it's really nice to be able to put a, a face to, to the names and, and get to know them before, you know, before I get onto camp. Yeah. So what's your plans for the short term uh, meetings and, and so far and the long term plan for the future? I think in the short term, it's about understanding it's great. You know, we've got a great new management team as well as lots of exciting players in the, in the squad and it's establishing that culture um, and the way we want to play and um, the philosophy around the sort of type of rugby that we want to play. Uh, and then obviously to push to, to get promoted up into the, to the trophy competition. I think that's a really um, achievable short term goal for us. And then the long term, uh, it's about, you know, growing rugby in Sweden. I think absolutely leaving a, a, a legacy here. You know, the players being able to leave a legacy from what they achieve. Um, and aspirations wise, I think long term, there's no, no harm in us put, you know, putting out there that we want to push to become a, a championship side in, in, in the long term. And I think, like I said before, the, we've got the players there, we've got the management there, and there's you know some really exciting club coaches around the club programmes, and I think all of those will help us achieve that goal. Okay, thank you very much. Sure, no, thank you very much.